Scientists are still working to find treatments for COVID. During Stanford-led clinical trials, a new shot is showing promise in warding off COVID host hospitalizations. This time, it's not a vaccine. Our Max Darrow explains. As COVID continues to adapt and evolve, scientists continue to try and develop new ways to combat the virus. We have seen a variety of uh, drugs uh, that have become available, but we've also seen many of those drugs become obsolescent because the virus has mutated and evolved. Dr. Jeffrey Glenn is a professor of medicine and microbiology at Stanford who spearheaded a Stanford medicine-led trial for a new COVID treatment, a single dose injection of Lambda interferon. It is a drug that can make a big difference. Glenn explained Lambda is a natural antiviral protein the human body makes to defend against viruses. He says a single Lambda injection can help make sure the body has an adequate amount of the natural antiviral. It's the body's first line of defense against viruses. The clinical trial results showed patients who were given a dose of the drug within seven days of the onset of COVID symptoms were half as likely to be hospitalized. Patients treated within three days of their symptom onset fared even better. And it was efficacious across all variants, including Omicron. And the side effects were the same as placebo. The doctors couldn't tell who was on drug, who was on placebo. Dr. Glenn says this treatment works differently than other COVID treatments available as it doesn't specifically target COVID. All the, the drug options we've had and have currently available are designed to target something in the virus. But that's why that's their Achilles heel, because when the virus mutates at that target site, the drug becomes ineffective. Lambda is different. Lambda activates something natural in our own bodies. It turns on our own antiviral defense mechanisms. This was a phase three study. There will have to be more regulations before patients would actually be able to access the drug outside of the clinical trial.